used to be so much different for your lifestyle and everything. Oh, uh, you know, it's, it's very different, but it's taken an adjusting period, but, you know, I love it out here, and you know, I'm growing uh, spiritually, mentally, and physically. Thank you. Amir, when, when did you start to feel 100% again, or are you still moving in that direction? Now, I, I say I started to feel like how I felt before I got hurt um, towards after the bowl game. Um, I just got a chance to really start running routes again and start doing speed training. I really think, you know, the winter workouts uh, really helped me you know, get my conditioning back up, getting my rhythm, running rhythm back up. So, you know, it was probably after the, after the bowl game. Did you ever wonder, is this thing ever going to heal? Yeah, you know, those thoughts you know, went through my head many a times. Um, but, you know, I just stayed prayerful, you know, kept my faith in God. And, uh, you know, I got healed and I can't wait to get out there in this opportunity that's presented to me. And the speed is back to where it was pre-injury? Yes. Yes, it is. Coach Kelly was talking about your speed. He's impressed. <laughs> I ask you know, I appreciate that, uh, but just always trying to get better, you know, doing speed training in the summertime and just, you know, trying to get right and uh, be at my optimum when the season starts. What, how do you envision your role on this team? Uh, to be honest, I don't know. Um, I, I pride myself on, you know, being versatile and trying to do as many things as possible, so you know, I'm going to leave the decision up to the coaches, you know, where they put me, but I'm going to make sure that I can do as much, give the coaches as many, you know, options to put me in places on the field as they can. Do you, when you uh, were rehabbing and so forth, I mean, did it help to have a dad that is in the profession that your dad is in? I mean, did that, was that helpful? I know you have great people here, but it's great to have another voice to help you get back. Yeah, you know, my daddy's been a very important figure in my life. Um, as you know, he's one of the best in, the, in his field and, you know, also as a spiritual mentor and you know, helping me, keeping me up, um, you know, when I was down and um, providing me, you know, different training, you know, with his expertise. So, you know, he's been someone who, I, you know, I couldn't be where I am today without him.